Patagonia, Cerveceria, Cerveceria, Patagonia. Yeah. The brewery. This is the beer garden. This is not the main area. Mm -hmm. The main area is actually, it's got an incredible view and there's yes. a main restaurant. But, but it is it, so loud, it sounds like yeah. a club in there. It's actually pretty loud here too. Yes. <laughs> but but uh, we decided to pick a little bit of a quieter spot to yeah. have our beer, have a meal, a little snack. And what we're gonna do afterwards is show you guys the stunning views. The views. The, the views are incredible. Mountains. Oh my gosh. But not from here. Not from here. From here. <laughs> so I got the amber beer. Yeah, I got Very an IPA. Nice. Cheers. Cheers, husband. I like oh. mine. Same it's here. It's nice and light. And we ordered the rustic potatoes, which yep. have, they're like potato wedges with cheddar cheese, lots of bacon, some chives. They also have empanadas on the menu, but there isn't a whole lot of selection if you want to eat outside. Um, if you want the full menu, you go to the restaurant. Hello there, and greetings from the future. <laughs> this is uh, the following day. The following day, so we're bringing yeah. you guys to a brewery. We are, because we didn't quite finish our food tour yesterday. We want to keep the good times going. Yes. We're going to show you a uh, cool pub tonight. It specializes in burgers and craft beers. And pizza. And pizzas, and you're getting a soup. Yeah. And uh, tomorrow we've also got one more restaurant. So yeah, the, the, food, the food keeps rolling on here in Barloche. And so what we've done is we've ordered a sampler portion of beer. And as you can see right here, they're all labeled. We've got Irish, APA, what's that one over there? Oh, the truffle and a milk stout. Yeah. So I'm gonna try them one by one. Oh, that's good. You know what, I'm so thirsty guys. Like, I don't know what went wrong today. I just didn't drink enough water. Those beers, those ice cold beers is perfect. Okay, that was that was good. That was a good start. Let's try this one. That was definitely lighter. I think you're gonna like yeah. that one the most. Yeah, yeah, we chose two and two, so I got two light yeah. ones, and Sam got two darker and now ones. We got, we've got a blonde over here. A blonde. This the is truffle. truffle. Let me tell you what truffle is. Oh, it's all in Spanish. Okay, it's from Patagonia. It's it's, it's gonna be floral, um, from what else I can tell. And it, it says it pairs well with chicken pot pie. Oh my. Yeah, nice and light, almost a little grapefruity. And um, the one that I'm excited about, the milk stout. You've already got some frothiness happening on the beard, on the mustache. <sighs> oh, guys, that's like, that's like a glass of dessert almost. It's got a, it's got a sweetness to it, a molasses, like gingerbread. It feels Ooh. like a gingerbread beer. Oh man, these are really good. Nice beers and it's cool to have a sampler like this to share. Okay, best ever burger man. Best ever burger guys. So there's 13 of them to choose from. Yeah. <laughs> I chose the New York because apparently it has double bacon. Let's take a look here. We've got a nice fried egg. It also comes with um, Jack Fry's four cheese sauce. Guys, that's an incredible burger. That's right up there with one of the best burgers I've had in a long time. It's a very good burger. Like if you're coming here to drink beer, you want something awesome to pair it with, definitely get the burger. The burger and the beer go so well together. Cheers. Cheers. Oh, I gotta try the fries for you. Oh. Oh, yeah. Those are good. The best part, keep the skin on the fries. Yes. Oh, yeah. We couldn't decide on which dessert we wanted to have, and then we noticed on their menu they have something called black and white. Brownie, 
and cheesecake. The brownie <laughs> comes with vanilla ice cream. And of course, the being the indulgent types of people that we are, we're like, yeah, let's go for a double dessert, right? Mm, that's a nice gooey brownie, my gosh. Gooey gooey, fresh out of the both, oven? Yeah. Yeah? They're both really nice desserts. So, we've paid the bill. Let's talk about the price. It was 23 US dollars. Not bad, oh. not bad. Another day, another, another day, another pint. Another pint. <laughs> another pint. Where are we today? Oh, uh, we are at Gilbert. Gilbert. Yeah, this is on the the very scenic small circuit route of, yeah, of Barloche. Yeah, Circuito Chico, exactly. Circuito Chico, and it's actually nearby the the place we went uh, a couple days ago, the Patagonia Brew House. Yeah, Patagonia maybe like Cerveceria. half a kilometer. Half a kilometer, and um, yeah, a nice a smaller place here. And they, they specialize in burgers, in goulash, in dishes with wild boar, which is what I'm going to order. And with the, deer? Deer. And, and trout? The, and trout. And you're getting trout. So we're, yes. we're eating very authentic local Patagonian dishes here. Mm -hmm. Trout, deer, boar. Specialties of this area. So couldn't be more excited. And yeah, I'm hungry. How's the beer? Are you thirsty Oh, I haven't too? even tried it yet. Is he thirsty or is he only hungry? Oh, it's a nice stout. Yeah. Oh man, it's like a meal in a glass. Meal in a glass before meal the glass. meal. The meal before the meal. The meal before the meal, exactly. There we go. There we go. Well guys, the mains are here. I got trout and I got it with the almond and leek sauce. That looks so good. It smells so good from over here. A very nice combination. I wouldn't have thought to make a sauce out of almonds, but it works really well with the leeks. And I got the rustic potatoes, which were really nice and golden. I ordered well. I chose well this time. Wild boar for the wild man. <laughs> I was just gonna say it's my first time to try a wild boar. So it looks oh, kind man. of like a stew, like a wild it, boar stew. It is a stew. It's it's. I think it's actually similar to a goulash, Ooh. and it's got a nice. Oh, the aromas, the smells from here is just wonderful. Right. I'm actually smelling some ginger as well. Ooh. That is melt in the mouth delicious. Mm -hmm. Like if you just told me this was straight up goulash, I I wouldn't know that I was eating wild boar. To, You'd be like, be okay. You'd be like, yeah. Pass it over. Pass it over. Give me more. I mean, it's delicious. If you get a chance to try wild boar while in Argentina, yeah. In this this part of the this region in Patagonia, mm -hmm. do it. I've heard that the wild boar population here is out of control, so that's probably one of the reasons why they're eating. Yeah, it. your your dad was warning us to watch out for them. When you go hiking, watch yeah. out for wild boar. They're unpredictable, apparently. Had a lovely lunch. Oh, that was amazing. It was good. Oh, it was so good. You know what? I have to admit, we weren't even planning on going out today. Mm -mm. So we woke up this morning. The weather was. This is the most beautiful day we've had since yes. we've been here. And I, we were gonna have a work day. I'm like, no way. We, we gotta to go, go out. We gotta go. Gotta go, out. go explore. So I just feel like I have a smile on my face all day. Yeah. Um, great meal, even better price. Yeah, so it came to 15, 16 US dollars. Yeah. So 750 per person that included beer, mm -hmm. included a delicious main. They brought yes. us bread to start off with. So we're feeling satisfied. We're gonna walk for a little while and try to build up an appetite for some tea and maybe a slice of cake. maybe half a kilometer to our next food stop. This place is called Punto Panoramico. 
It means panoramic point and the restaurant could not have a better location. We have views of snow-capped mountains, forest, the lake. As far as the eye can see. And we can see the luxurious Dao Dao Hotel yeah. off in the distance. I want to say this is one of the most beautiful places in Patagonia, but we've just started. We're just yeah. like at the tip of it and we're just going to be traveling south over the next few yeah. months. <laughs> I mean, there's a, reason, there's a reason people come to Patagonia oh, to live, to travel. Mm. I mean, when you're visiting, especially with nice weather like this, mm. it's just, this is just Incredible. fairy tale land. Did I mention what I'm having? Nope. <laughs> Carrot cake with icing. It is delicious. Cream cheese? Oh, yeah. Oh, thank, it is thank goodness. Good. So happy to have the, the real deal carrot cake here. I'm so happy to be here. We're going to show you guys the views as soon as we're done our dessert. We are. Yeah. 